At one point in Rostislav Masterov's career, he was considered the worst hockey player in all of Europe. But despite that, he had dreams and big dreams at that. Rusty, he wanted to be a National Hockey League player. He might not have had the skill to do it, but you know what he did have? He had the heart. Rusty gave it his all each and every game and earned a spot at the bottom of the NHL draft. That is right. We got picked with the last possible pick here in NHL 23, but the good news is we went to the former Stanley cup champs the colorado avalanche in the preseason we gave it our all day in day out we grinded we fought for our teammates we scored nasty goals we also witnessed some of the strangest be a pro moments that i have ever seen Up the defender for an own goal. oh wait ever seen this and we do have an opportunity oh wait i can't even see what happened this is the replay that we get the puck wait what in the world but all of that hard work has led to today, our first NHL game and our first opportunity to play on the official Colorado Avalanche roster. Today, Rusty will be scoring his first career NHL goal, and we will be winning our first career NHL game to start NHL 23. Let's get into it. Okay, up first, we are going to have a talk with Coach before our first game. As, okay, Rusty is still number 58. That's a bummer. Hey, Rostislav, you've shown that your offensive skills are worth taking a chance on, but I need to see how you perform in the big leagues. Okay, so this is going to be our start where we get to unlock our first X Factor, which is the Spinorama. We do have a couple options here. I won't let you down, Coach. I'll show you what I can be an asset or no problem, Coach. I'll prove you have nothing. Are these not the exact same responses both ways? He's hello, Rusty. I'm going to take the nice team answer. We'll try to get our team play up. Good luck out there. Thanks, coach. Thanks. Very inspiring from our coach today. Just please give me my number back. That's all. That, 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 okay. Thanks, coach. Thanks. Yep. 61. Okay. All right. We have a text. All right. We have a conversation with Boro here. I can't wait to see Nashrov in action. My new favorite player. No doubt. Go Avalanche. Let's go. Okay. This is how we unlock. Play for this team for five years just to unlock Magnetic. Holy, dude. It's that tough? I mean, thanks, Boro, but no guarantees I'll be here in five years. We might be jumping around a little bit. My goodness. That's our that's our nice text back to Boro. Okay. Go ahead and take a seat, Boro. All right. I might not be here. Last but not least, of course, we have the reporter coming in. You went from the draft floor to being drafted, going through the preseason, and now it's time for your NHL debut. Hey! It's about time a reporter hyped me up for the first time ever. Really excited about it and expecting a challenging but fun game. Yes. For those who haven't followed your career thus far, how would you describe yourself as a player? Okay, I only have one option. I'm mostly a team player. Sick. Though you're known as a team player, do you think you could carry your team to victory? I'm fully focusing on my team. Okay. Hey, listen. Listen. We're going to take the nice safe answers here. Rusty's a changed man. We are a nice team player. Most importantly, I want to get my number back. And I think to do that, we got to get on management side. We got to get on the team side. I don't care about my brand as much. This is good. Here we are. Rusty getting ready to enter the arena for his first NHL game. Look at the tinted visor on Russ. That's an intimidating player right there. Let's go, Russ. This is what we play for, boys. This is what we play for. And there we go, Rusty. Sprinting on down. All right. Here we are. Ball Arena. The Colorado Avalanche taking on the Chicago Blackhawks. And it is Rusty's first NHL game. No, we are not on the first line, but we should be getting a lot of minutes here as we are sitting on the second line. Okay, it feels good to actually be getting on the ice a little bit. There's Bergeron! Yo! We haven't seen this guy since literally the first, like, three seconds of this Be A Pro series. And he is actually on our team. So it is me, Bergeron. I don't know who our right wing is. I'm actually on left wing. We got Bergeron center. He's the guy I'm going to have to beat out to get second line center, which probably is never going to... Did he just ice it? Bergeron just iced the puck. What in the world? Patrice, I was just hyping you up. I'm trying to take your spot and that's what you do? Dude, I have literally never seen anyone do that before. Never, never. And Patrice Bergeron, of course, is the first to do it. All right, boys, we're taking on the Chicago Blackhawks. This just absolutely has to be a W. And we do absolutely need to get our first career goal here. And of course, he's, he tries to dump it. He goes off sides. What is happening to our line? Hello? Dude, if, if they try to dump it one more time, I might be playing on the worst line in hockey. As here they come on a two-on-one, we're going to get a goal against to start. We get a goal against. I have not touched the puck one single time yet. 
all they've done is try to enter the zone, go offside, and ice it. That is all this second line has done. And Tyler Johnson goes down on a two-on-one. We are down 1-0 in our first career NHL game. All right, the speed of the game is a little bit faster than what we are used to, obviously. We got Burzy. Burzy, go ahead. Feed me. Let's go. Rusty. Wheels. We're trying to... Tried to find the forehand backhand. It's still sitting there, but no. We did not we did not get the bounce that we wanted. Not a bad move. I think we maybe could have forced the cross crease, but that's a nice safe play. Dude, coach is going with these crazy aggressive setups. Here's oh, shot. Tip. And we I, I think I whiffed that tip. It might have been the slowest muffin of a shot I've ever seen, and we still whiffed it. All right, Bergy's starting to finally win some draws. He's doing what he does best. I'm gonna sit front. Nice tip there for Russ to go for a big hit. Take a seat there, Vlassie. Take a seat. All right, boys, I'm taking this very serious. Again, this is, I mean, it's still a monumental moment because at any moment we could be sh we could be sent down to the third line, sent down to the fourth line, work our way down to the minors. We're still fighting for that spot. Let's go, Rusty. The green, oh, ugh. that is an ugly first goal for Rostislav Nastrov, but a goal. Yo, that was kind of hype. Who's that guy? Oh, we're, we're keeping the puck. Let's go. Rusty with his first career NHL goal. And it is one of one of the most ugly goals that you will ever see. But you know what? A goal is a goal. Counts the same on the score sheet. And Rusty has his first ever. Let's go, boys. I'm not going to lie. That first shift, I thought our NHL career was over. But you know what? Rusty's starting to figure it out a little bit here. All right, we got Smitty. Smitty, beat Yo, chill. Here we go, Landy. Nice pass. Let's go. Oh, okay. That was a little much by Busty. I'm not going to lie. A little much. We got Chell Diamond tweeting out hopefully the first of many. Congrats, kid. Yo, shout out to at Chell Diamond on Twitter. Just an absolutely buzzing Twitter account there. Oh! oh, no. Now, that's the one that you want to get as your first career goal right there. We're going to reset this again. I'm being more of a team player this year. Gerard, feed me. Nice hit. All right, hey, there's a little bit of energy in this building. I'm gonna stay out here for one more quick rush up the ice. And we're gonna go. Here we go. Okay, that's a big turnover for Rusty. And a big save. I'm gonna get off the ice. That's my bad. That's my bad. Coach, all I'm asking for is one more. Sh we do get one more shift. Okay. Hey, being on the second line is kind of nice here. I mean, hopefully we'll work our way up and get to play with McKinnon, Ranton, and Landis Cog, those kind of guys. But listen, Bergey, and I still don't know who our other right wing is. I'll be honest. I have no clue. But playing with Bergey has not been too bad. Oh, is that Smitty? I think we have Smitty on. Yeah, we do have Smith. I didn't realize Smith was on our line. I thought he was playing on the third line. Let's try to get one more clean rush up the ice as Bergey's going to take it in. There's the classic Bergey dump, just leading to absolutely nothing. I hate playing with this guy. Uh, coach pulled us out for the last 18 seconds here. That's fine, though. You know, I, I, I trust this first line to actually go out there. And... Not a bad play. Ten seconds left. Oh, dude, it's nice actually having some teammates, man. We got Kale out here. Landeskog ranting in out here. Landeskog fully healthy. I, I think he also just hit Doc with a reverse hit right there, which was kind of sick. So a bit of a... Yo, Smith's helmet went flying. Bit of a greasy start for the boys. But again... A goal is a goal. Rusty got his first one ever, but now it is about getting the team their first win of the season. All right, despite having our goal, I feel like we really have not had any sort of setup so far. It just feels like we're going quick rushes up the ice, getting bodied. Come on. You got to make that save. That's not even, a, it's not even a good shot. I'll let him shoot that all day. We don't even get to see the replay, of course. He just literally stops in place, fires a no-look slap shot as I'm standing right in front of him. I tried to get a stick on it, tried to get the block on it, but unfortunately was a little bit too late. So Rusty with a little mistake on defense, but you know what? We make up for it with our offensive ability. We're going to try to cut back door here. Pop! Rusty hit the net, man. All I'm asking is for you to hit the net. Back door. <sighs> Teeing up that one. See, I'm looking for you again. We're trying to be that good team player. We're coming out here. We're laying the body, and now we're going to go. Let's go. We got one more rush. We're going to try to feed that low. And then I'm going to come back door. Smitty. <gasps> Smitty. Dude, I tell you what, Smith is taking an absolute beating out here. At some point in this game, we might need to stand up for him because his helmet's gone flying into the bench. Every single time I see him get hit, he's not just getting bumped. He's getting absolutely rocked. All right, the good news is we are playing on a bit of longer periods for this first game of the season. I wanted to, like, have the chance to go out here and actually do, do something. So we're going to get our chances. If we keep playing the way that we are, we get a nice little setup and Smith stops getting absolutely... <gasps> 
Let's go! Rusty! What a shot, dude! That's just good. Tell me that you guys just saw. Was that Devontae's? Did you guys see his arm? <laughs> You gotta, gotta show the slow-mo replay of Taze. His arm, I, I think it's he might be out for the... Okay, he's not out for the season. He's back on the ice in the next shift. It's just another day playing be a pro here in HL 23. And Rusty has scored. And we've got another power play out of it somehow too. I don't know what's going on. We have been blessed. Okay, we did not get any power play time there, but that's fine. Rusty's out here, I mean, completely carrying the team, and Coach is still not giving us any minutes. Nice cut. We're going to find that low. <gasps> Titty! Oh, I tried the dive! Rusty tried the diving desperation shot. Did not get a piece of it, but that's okay. We're going to set this. Dump it low. It's better than losing the puck for nothing. We'll take that all day. Try right, nice little feed. We're going to find this low. <gasps> Let's go! And Rostislav Nashrov and the hats go flying. Oh my goodness. Do you believe in miracles? Rusty cutting across, finding the lane, and the shots are there. Obviously, Chicago, you know, not going to be the, the best opponent that we play all year. Huso and Net, obviously, not going to be the best goalie that we play all year. But holy, Rusty with his first game, first hat trick, and hopefully our first win. What a start for Rusty and the boys. All right, first game, first Hattie. This is not what we expected from Rostislav Nashrov. This is going much better than we ever could have dreamed. You know what would make... Okay, going for the Michigan, maybe a little too cocky. We got three goals of our three. We need our first line to start producing, and I have a feeling this game is still not over. All right, eight minutes left. No goals against, no goals against. We also need coach to keep giving us these minutes. If, if we go out here and score literally every shit. I thought somebody was going to drop the gloves there. I thought I thought somebody was going to stick up for Rostov Nashrov, the only guy on this team, but apparently not. We're going to do a little toey. Okay, I'm trying to trying to do too much. Trying to do too much. Let's just chill. Bergy is so good defensively. He's done absolutely nothing on offense, but he... <gasps> Ref! Ref, what was that bump? I was going to go for the backward skating between the legs there. Good little effort from Russ. But we'll get off and uh, let some other people have it. Dude, I have not seen Smith on his feet for more than 10 seconds at a time this game. Every single time he enters the zone, he is getting bodied by two or three guys at once. <laughs> Oh, you gotta feel bad for the guy. That's where that's where the six four. Oh my! <laughs> for sure, dude. His feet went ten feet into the air. What is going on? Okay, the score is three to two. Rusty has his three goals. We're playing phenomenal hockey. We've done everything that we need to do. Now, can our defense come in clutch? Can our defense hold on to the one goal lead? And can we get our first win? And keep it in regulation. I don't want to go to a shootout, especially after what we saw the last time. And I do not want to risk OT, even though we probably would get some OT time. We're going to win this in regulation, call it a day, and get out of here. Here we go. We are getting the starting shift here in the third period. Coach is starting to finally have some trust in this lineup. What a move from Rusty. And Smitty with his first goal. Dude, that spin move from Rostislav Nashrov is absolutely unmatched. We don't even have the spinorama X Factor. We don't even need it. A beautiful spin done to perfection. And Riley Smith there to bury it. Let's go, boys. 4 2 for the Avs. All right, huge hit. Devontae's. Hold on. We got a little bit of wheels. We got a little bit of wheels. Slides it. Oh! Oh, no. Rusty, slow to get up. We are going to be forced to go to the bench after losing my helmet. And there we go. We are sprinting. My helmet's getting shoved down the ice. Rusty's forced off. That's a tough shift from Rusty. All right, Rusty, back on the ice here. Hold on. I'm going to be a little bit late, but I might be, I might be able to bury this. Nice shot. Nice shot. A couple good saves there. We got Jonesy. Dude, I love how we're randomly getting bumped. Like, left side, right side. I'm just all over the place right now. It does look like... Oh, no. Wait, is Bergeron... Bergeron might be hurt. Or... Oh, no. This is a power play line. Okay. I, I don't know what's happening. We got a little power play action here. Go ahead, new hooky. Hooky gets it to me. We're going to go a little spinner. Top right. I want to go opposite side, but instead we get... Find that... Oh, what a save. Oh, that would have been nice to have. A four-goal night from Rusty would have just been unreal, but who's with the beautiful-looking save there? What... 
that the exorcism that I just saw? Did we just, did he, his head just got stuck on the crossbar and he bent back. I've never seen that. Dude, what in the war? Bran! What a save! Okay, we're getting to the point in the episode where the, the madness starts to happen. <laughs> back to back to back, crazy saves. Don't know what's going on in, in the net, but here we are. 4-2, 10 minutes left. As long as we keep this lead, we're fine. All right, huge hit on Vlasic. Huge hit. He's going to be down and out. They're going to have to go a little odd man here. Here's Tades. He's going to look for that backdoor feed. We're not going to allow it. I'm going to stay a little bit lower just to cover that shot. Beautiful. Let's go. One last rush before we get off here. I have a feeling something bad is going to happen when we get off the ice. There's just, without a doubt, two goals are going into the back of the net. We're going to be out there. It's going to be 4-4 with a minute on the clock. We're going to be thinking to ourselves, what happened? What, what went wrong with the coaching? And it's going to be all because Rusty was not on the ice. Here we go. You ready? This is how it begins. One whistle. No. No goals against. The Avs came to play. 4-2. Rusty with three of them. We got three minutes left. We're going to come out here. We're going to play good, smart hockey. I'm going to play very defensive. Watch this. Boom. You make the hit. You keep him out. They got to reset this. They got to reset this. How does he still have this puck? God. Huge turnover. That is, I, I don't know who that, that was Kale McCarr in the corner with the biggest turnover of his career. I don't know who that pass was going to. I I definitely didn't call for it. I didn't see anyone call for it. Kale McCarr just gave the puck right to them mid slot, let him go back door. And just like that is a 4-3 game. I right, know nothing crazy here. Nothing crazy. I saved it, friend. And let's go. Three minutes. I'm going to try to find you, Smitty. Nice. Okay, we took the hit. We made the play. We got a two-on-one. Smith flies it wide. Give him some help up the wing. Hit him with a little toey. And we just got sat down and teabagged in the process. We got two and a half minutes. I'm not going to take a Marshawn change, though. I'm going to cover my back door. Nothing there. Nice save, Frank. Nothing there. Nice save. Okay. We're not going to get the last hit of the game. It's going to be up to our AI, and we're going to see what lines one, three, and four can do. Minute 30 left. Chicago, of course, going to be on the push. We are going to have a goalie pull coming here shortly. Unless, unless we can keep possession of this puck. Good play there. And as you can see, Rusty's on the bench standing up. And boom! Rantanen steals the deal. A huge play from Miko Rantanen. As he goes down and buries it. Rusty getting ready to get on the ice, but he doesn't need to. Rantanen buries his first goal of the season. Let's take another look at this one. Cutting down. Gets a little B-way. It goes for a one-hander. Oh my, ranting it, how do you do? All right, boys, what a start to this season. As Rantanen secures the, uh, hold on, uh, let's not say secures the win yet, because you guys know crazier things, crazier things have certainly happened. Good little feed, did not realize there was an empty net. Go ahead, Bergey, go ahead, Bergey, and boom, there it is. Teals the deal, empty netter, Smitty with the berry, dump the puck low, Bergey's there to pick it up, Smitty's there to seal the deal. And just like that, the Colorado Avalanche with their first win of the season. All right, 10 seconds left. You know what? We're going for more goals. We're playing for a future contract here. Watch this, Rusty. Cut across. Boom! The shot could have been better for sure, but the game could not have. A 6-3 victory for the Colorado Avalanche. A hat trick for Rostislav Nastrov and a beautiful spin move assist to go along with it. You can't ask for a better game than what we just saw as the Colorado Avalanche take their first one at home. Rusty plays the best game that he could have played. And just like that, I think we're going to get bumped up to the first line. No joke. There's Rusty heading to the locker room. The fans are hyped. Coach, not exactly a goal, but they can't score if we hem them in their zone. Coach, I buried three. I buried three. And I'm still getting chirped. And I'm saying that there's more time to score still. Come on, coach. Let's go, boys. Let's go. That is why we play. Moments like that, opportunities like that. We're getting a huge bump up on our line. We're up to the midway point there of the second line. Power play going up as well. PK going down for some reason. I don't even think I was out there for a PK goal against. But you know what? I don't even care. I'll play the power play all day long. Let the other guys handle that. Rusty and the boys will continue to rally. A five-point night in our first game. Rostislav Nashrov, this was your first official game. You looked right at home on the ice, and you scored your first goal of your career. How did you feel? Felt amazing first. Yeah, we're taking we're taking some star answers now. Should we get used to you scoring every game? Let's do it. I'm, hey, listen. At some point, you make the jump from the, the team player that goes out there and grinds 
to the cockiest guy out on the ice. And once you score five points in your first career NHL game, I think you have the opportunity to do that. We do have to score a goal in our next game, which we'll see if that happens. So there we have it. That is going to do it for today's episode. Rusty with his first career NHL game, his first career NHL goal, his first career NHL hat trick, and five points in his first game. I don't know what was going on. Everything was going right. Everything was clicking. I don't think this is going to continue, but we sure hope that it will. As always, if you guys are enjoying Be A Pro with Rusty, you know what to do. Hit the video with a like to let me know. Hit that subscribe button. We're on the road to 1 million subscribers and more Rusty craziness is on the way. I'm Nasher and I'm out. Peace. Yeah.